Hello and welcome to the Axe Show. We're going to make an axe for you, decided by these dice or die before I get shouted out in the comment section. So, let me tell you something. Mm. Each one of these dice will set us a, uh, a little hurdle we have to overcome, or a boundary, should I say. Yes. This one is a budget dice. Right. Tell the guys what that does. Right. So, this will give us the budget of the axe. So, it could be anything from £10 to £200 plus. That's Beautiful. the one we want. Absolutely. Bit of freedom there. Then we've got the type of act. This will be like impromptu, strolling, stage, close-up, mystery. So mystery, we can choose what we want or does Jamie choose? Um, I reckon we choose. Yeah, we choose. We, we choose. And the last one is a restriction dice. No Alakazam product. So that might Ooh. as well say no 100% killer practical instant reset magic. Now, they are all obviously different. No coin tricks, no card tricks, no sleight of hand. One of them says no talking, and yeah, that is that's the worst. One. So, we're gonna roll the dice. Let's see what we end up with. Let's go for budget first. Oh! 75 quid. 75 schmackers right there. Okay, that's a good one. That gives yep. us a little bit of freedom. Uh, what do you want? Let's we'll do the go. act, yeah. Let's do it. Yeah, the type of act on it. Impromptu. Nice. I like it. So that's impromptu or impromptu looking? Yep, 100%. <gasps> no no mentalism. mentalism. Oh, That's going to be hard. Nah, we can do this. Okay, let's do it. £75 impromptu, no mentalism. So when we're creating an act, um, the general rule is we look for uh, three items mm. and we want... A opener, middler, yeah. end. That's pretty much what we go for. Yeah, we do try and do that. Okay, so let's go. And remember, we want this to uh, to appear impromptu. So even though we are looking at tricks and buying tricks, we want those tricks to appear like they're impromptu. They're things that are on us or things that yeah. we could use around about. 100%. Right? Um, so I... I'm gutted we're out of, I would have just said the forks. I know, because when you're out and about, you could do that. You can do it. It's still a product. Should we say them then? Yeah. I, and that's a really good shout. All right. The liquid forks. I'm going to grab one fork. You grab one Because fork. we're out of them for the boxes, but we've obviously got forks if anyone wants to see them down here. This, so, ladies and gentlemen. Jamie, I'm going to, I'm going to hand this over to you for a moment. And I just want you to say if I can use this, because impromptu, usually when I'm out and about with family um, or in the pub, I do have a die box with Yeah, me. he does. He does so, have a spit die box in his pocket. I do usually just take that out and about. No one right. questions you now, do they? No. For three months. Yeah, they go, what's that? I just go, I just carry it as a dice. Right, split, so, split die box. first trick, liquid forks. Liquid forks, forks guys, this is brilliant. It's on the website, twenty four ninety nine. you get 50 forks. But the good thing this is, you get taught the liquid forks routine. So, you don't have to carry a fork in you, even though these are the best Hang forks. Hang on a minute. What? No mentalism. Are we... This ain't mentalism. Okay. This is, it's I would not, say mentalism is mind reading. Yeah. That's what I'd say. But yeah, so you get taught the liquid forks routine on here, yeah, which means if you go to a restaurant and they have appropriate forks, you can do it with their forks. So that is impromptu. But if you go to gigs or you perform with friends and family, get these bad boys. But yeah, liquid mm. forks, twenty four ninety nine. Mm. Let's just say twenty five pounds. Still got fifty bob. Fifty? No, we ain't. Fifty quid. How much have we got, Emma? Not fifty bob. Yeah, what's what's fifty quid? Two pound fifty. Yeah, what's fifty pound? But in in like quid. Fifty quid. How is it? Yeah. Oh. A bullseye. I'm We've not got being... a bullseye left. This is going to sound rude, but I'm not trying to be rude. Were crowns around when you were born or not? I'm not trying to be rude. No. When were they? I'm not, I'm not trying to be honest. I can't work out. No, we, we, we had the same money as you. We still had sixpences, right? Yes, yeah, No, we didn't. Uh, well, I remember having sixpences. Yeah, but you're older than me. You're older than me. By six days. Yeah, well, they most probably went out of fashion in that six, six days. Six days, six I'm seeing a lot of things going on there. Remember a six pence? Only in a Christmas pudding. No, it's worth two and a half pence. But I used to get one from the tooth fairy, and my aunt used to collect them in a dimple bottle. What's what the hell is a dimple bottle? Is that what gives you these bad boys? This is so good. Oh, 
Oh, wowza. What you got? Could get any of these. Uh, well, you can't afford a lot of those. You can't afford exact change. Exact change think. is mentalism. <laughs> do you know what's annoying me? Yeah, Jamie behind the camera. I'm going to bait him out now. Say, do exact change. <laughs> Anyway, um, exact changes in my top three tricks all the yeah, time. Yeah, isn't that like 80 quid or something? It's about 70-ish quid, quid, yeah. Hyder key's good. That's £60, though, so we, haven't, we can't get that, but that's a really good Hyder key plus. Extreme burn we can get, and that's money, Yeah, isn't it? The other thing I was thinking of, once again, which... Oh! No, that's mentalism. Can you not I'll, do magic and just snap your fingers and say, your card's now in this envelope, isn't it? <sighs> so... And it's stuff that Hang on, you should you can have take on you. one of those. I, yeah, you have an extreme burn. Yeah, yeah. Extreme burn. Bang. What? Uh, this is looking sublime. Right, remember, so impromptu's got to be stuff that looks like, oh, Dad, I see what you just grabbed over there. Look at, look how excited he is. Look at his nose. That's how, that, when he gets excited, look, his nose is because doing it. Because that, with that. Oh, my gosh. All right, hang on. Yeah. I think that's a good act right there. But if we've still got money, then I do feel we throw in a thumb tip. I think that's a good act. Yeah, it is. I'm looking for D'Angelo's touch. Don't worry about that. All right, yeah, thumb tip, extreme burn, that, that. Oh, my gosh, that's brilliant. I think, I think that's a really good act. Really good how act. How good is that? So how um, would you start it, then? Okay. Extreme burn. I would start with extreme burn. I probably wouldn't use this in the act, but seeing yeah. as we've got the budget... Yeah. Everyone should have one of these. Assault, pour, uh, yeah. anything. Yeah. So Vanishing Hank. We're just chucking this in as part of our impromptu set, but we're not even going to use it for the act, but it will be in our pocket if we want to extend the act for it's anything. It's great. It's so so I would start off by doing uh, Extreme Burn. Yep. Then I would go into moving the fork with the loops. Mm -hmm. Then you can do things like borrowing a banknote. You could take a banknote off this. Yep. Float the banknote with the loops, yep. then get the fork out, start moving the fork, then get the fork, bend it up with uh, using liquid forks as your routine, and then hand the fork out so they have that as a souvenir. That's just sublime, isn't it? That's a strong act. So good. That could be one of the best acts we've ever put together. I really think it is. That's a good, solid four or five minutes of performance. Ooh. And that is 75 We're going to have to redo that because... Even that one, great. But that's well, that how, is brilliant. Let's do it again then. Just a really let's... good noise. Did that hurt you? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> but how that was brilliant. What an act, guys! Let us know in the comment section what you would have gone for, and rate this act out of ten. I seriously think this is great, isn't it? I think you're right. I think this is one of the strongest acts with very little props. Start with extreme burn. Use one no of the notes. No cards in sight. Yeah. Use one of the uh, the notes to float yeah. it using the loops. Then bring out the fork or use the fork off the table if it's appropriate. Uh, move the fork with the loops. Then pick up the fork, go into your metal bending routine, leave that as a souvenir, and that is a solid act. I've got and tears on my eyes. You've got that as a little backup. That's because brilliant. Because we had the money. And if we've still got a little bit of budget, Jamie, we will stick in a little silk. A little silk handkerchief. That is so good. Guys, honestly, 10 out of 10. Well done. Right, yeah. guys, well done, that 18. was... An the impromptu. No, well, that, it was, but that yeah. was also impromptu. No mentalism for £75. There you go. Thank you so much, guys. Enjoy.